Hey, yo, what's up? So, a lot of people want to know why certain things happen. Alright, so I'm just going to break it down the best I can. There's news every day, right? People are getting killed every fucking day, right? New York, fucking... What was it before when I was young? It was somebody's born every... Every minute, somebody, our baby born every second, somebody dies every minute. We passed that up long ago. And so, from an outside perspective, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep it a buck with everybody about this King Von murder. From a very outside perspective, no disrespect. Just gonna keep it a buck. From what I seen. All right. I was a young cat once, you know. And so I see this guy in this Rondo. This Quando Rondo, right? ATL, I think. Okay. Well, here's how it goes in my perception of everything I've read, everything I've watched, everything I've seen, everything I've heard, everything that's been said, what the last words were, all of this stuff. I'm going to keep it real. I'm Native American. Oh, blah, blah, that kind. All right. And so, you want to know the real reason they killed King Vaughn? You want to know the real reason why I, that, that, that young man was killed that night? <sighs> because he was bigger, faster, and stronger, smoother than Rondo. fact don't even know the homie can just tell by the way he moves can tell by the way his stories go can tell by the way rondo moves and the way that he has his young boy that does exactly what vaughn was doing right so rondo's a boss right but nba is his boss so what vaughn had going on with his, with, with, oh, was more of a partner at the, at, with his boy. You know, they actually talked. It was more of a brother relationship, in my opinion. You don't have to hear it. You don't have to like it. I'm just telling you as a dude that sits out for, outside the box. But I have come in it, and before anybody says, oh, it's some white boy, no, I'm Native American, I've been in this, I've, trust me, I've had a gun to my face. All right, in the project. So don't think I'm just trying to talk, I'm telling you. King Vaughn, they're at the club. King Vaughn, I was that age before. King Vaughn looks a certain way. King Vaughn moved a certain way. Other cats don't like that shit. They'll just sit there and mean mug you. I guarantee they're like, fuck that pretty boy. Shit like that. But they don't but they also know that pretty boy can get down. So what do they do? They see, hey, this guy's out because he could move like that. He shouldn't have, but at that age, you you feel bulletproof. Literally. King Vaughn was gonna was gonna stomp out Rondo. They knew it. They knew Rondo instantly was going to be stomped the fuck out. This should be all you need. But nah. Has to be this, right? All the time. Bang. What'd you get accomplished? Now you're sitting behind bars. Stupid shit. Kids. They all say, oh, the Kobe. I want to be like Kobe. I want to be like Mike. Really? Really? No, you don't. You want to be them. You don't want to be like them. You want to be them. And that's the difference. And you'll risk it all for nothing. Because you just don't like the way somebody else's hustle is bigger and better than yours might be. No offense. There's the real reason. God bless.